Kiddo. Wow. Kiddo for Real Life People, Hi, and we baby. are broadcasting on YouTube and Facebook right now. Uh, had a little technical difficulties getting this uh, week started, but here we are, and it is Waffle Week. Waffles. Waffles. You know, I hear all this stuff. Now, I got to try my first chaffles this week, y'all. I have not done any chaffles at all, okay? Um, but... I was at a group member friend's house this weekend, and she made chaffles, and they were very, very tasty. I have to say so. But that got me thinking about waffles and all the different ways we could do waffles. We can do savory waffles with traditional keto waffles with my amazing miracle flour. Um, we're going to do pumpkin spice waffles today to kick off the week. But think waffle bowls, think waffle cones, think uh, carnivore waffles, think waffles. Carnivore waffles? Yes, I got a great recipe coming up this week. It's going to be a carnivore waffle. We are going to be doing all kinds of waffles, y'all. Now, I know that on Facebook I said I was going to try to go live at 4, but hey, I haven't seen my mom in almost a month, and she came by today. So I know. Hey. I asked her. I said, Mom, she said, are you going to do a live with me? I was like, well, what time is it scheduled? 6? She said, no, it's scheduled I wanted but my grandma it. was here whenever but, I got here. But like she I said, I like, haven't seen my mama in a long time. And she came over and I spent some time with my mama. Well, you know what? If you really stop and think about it, this is the first time we've really got to hang out or do anything together in over a week. We've been so busy. Busy. So busy. I was gone weeks. for a week. She was gone when I got back. We I'm had thirsty. a couple days to connect. Me too. And then um, it was just like right back into it. Like, can I have a drink of that? Yeah, you got to hold a straw because it's needle. <laughs> It's a needle straw. Okay, so guys, we're going to start out today with the waffle recipe that I have already posted on my website, okay? It is uh, keto waffles, but we are going to spice it up. We are going to uh, make some pumpkin spice waffles because, hey, it's hot and we're already wishing for fall. It's not fall, but it's, we're wishing for it. It's like somebody posted stuff on Facebook and it says it's like all the girls dancing. They're like, I'm ready, I'm ready for Sweater weather. I want sweater yeah, weather. Sweater so weather. we're going to... That's we're cute. Gonna, what a weather. Yeah. yeah. All right. Okay. Um, I can't see what's happening. I know yeah, they're just saying hi. Hi. Because you know me. I got to do something. It wasn't me. Okay. Hey, so, what do y'all think of this clean eating challenge, though? Like, it's actually doing pretty good. She's doing it? awesome. <laughs> I'm just sitting here. I'm like, I'm this, like is the first, doing awesome. this is the first time there's been able to be like a full body on that. Yeah. Yeah. She's flattening down. I was showing some pictures off of you earlier. I don't know why, but in my wallet, I don't know how or why. But you can look right over in there. There's one of your wedding pictures when you were a teenager. Oh, yeah, when I was all... And there she won't bring it. Who were you showing them to? Uh, Nelda. And she was like, I just can't, I just can't believe that. Because they've never, I mean... Y'all, I used to be, I used to be a lot more than I am now. Yeah, she was. So we're going to start out with some stuff. I got the waffle maker heating up. We're going to make waffles real quick. They go really quick. Now, I do have, I want to get the mini chaffle, the, the little mini waffle makers, but apparently waffles are kind of crazy right now and you can't get them. But uh, I did share links on Facebook. I will share them on YouTube as well for uh, the waffle makers. I have this Dash 4 waffle maker. I also have the Dash. Would you grab that, baby? I'll show them what we're doing. It's right behind that. It's in my living room. It is a tiny straw. I don't know what happened to my big straw. I thought this little one is dangerous. Yes, but I have this waffle maker we're going to use tonight. It makes four square waffles. So and we that's have like this one. Four. This is the Dash Waffle Bowl Maker. And we're going to be using what those that taco this week. shells are being made out of. I also have a mystery waffle maker being uh, uh, delivered to my house tomorrow for a new waffle that we're going to work on. Now, you guys use whatever waffle maker you have, okay? Uh, I, I'm not affiliated with Dash Waffle Makers, by the way, at all. And anyway, they don't even know who I am. So <laughs> I'm just saying we like the brand, and it seems to be a popular brand that everybody's buying and using. So let's get ready. We got any comments already? They're just saying hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. So I let's talk ingredients, because you know I always talk ingredients. Uh, that bowl right there. This is going to be almond? No, lupin flour. Lupin. Lupin flour. Okay. The lupin flour, I think, you know, it originates in Australia, Perfect. but every time I say lupin, I want to think of der Swedish. I want to say it's the lupin flour, and it's a half a cup, and we're going to put it through a little sifter. Have you not made your waffles for them yet? 
Yeah, but we're making pumpkin spice ones, so I gotta make it again. That's all I gotta do. <laughs> I'm not I complaining, y'all. I like to sift it, you guys, because you know it gets these little balls, these little clumps, and everything. And you don't, you know, I like to smooth it out. This is a quarter cup of egg white protein powder. Oh. Now let's talk about protein real quick. If you don't have egg white protein powder and you have whey protein or whey isolate or maybe you have pea protein or another style of protein, you use the protein you like. This is the one I happen to have. Uh, if you need links to all of this and you need to order it on Amazon, you can, but I will tell you, you can easily find protein powders at your local health food stores. You can find them at Sprouts, Whole Food, Natural Foods, Trader Joe's. Are you uh, sifting you name everything them. together? All my dry ingredients I'm going to sift because look, you get these little bitty teeny lumps like sand that don't want to come out. All right, next is oat fiber. Again, I have a quarter cup of that. So we've got a total cup of one cup flour. One cup flour. And I sift it right through there. I guess I need a be cautious in my face. I'm like mean money. And then this one is allulose. I have got two tablespoons of sweetener. Now listen, allulose is close to table sugar, okay? So it's it, it balances out. Allulose is almost cup per cup of table sugar. It's 70% less sweet than regular. If you were going to change your sweetener, you're more than welcome. You can use monk fruit, erythritol, stevia, xylitol, whichever one you want. Start off with one tablespoon and work your way up because erythritol and monk fruit and uh, it takes yeah, less is more with that yeah it takes a lot less of that so I've got two tablespoons of allulose going in and then I have a teaspoon and a half of baking oh this is actually my gum I'm using a little bit of inulin which is uh, also known as chicory root and that is a half a teaspoon again when it comes to this this is a forgiving yes. recipe yeah it's a forgiving recipe, you guys. I like to add it because it brings a little thickness to the batter. But you can use guar gum, you can use konjac uh, root, you can use xanthan gum, just whichever one you want. This is one and a half teaspoons of baking powder. Do you have there two bowls? Are you separating the eggs or something? No, I just had an egg sitting in a coat and roll. And then we have a quarter teaspoon of salt, which does not have to be sifted. We just dump it in there. And then, last but not least, I have a tablespoon of pumpkin spice. Ha! Huh, you're like, well, we were wondering where the pumpkin spice was going to come through here. Now, I thought about, I thought about adding pumpkin puree to this, but I really didn't want to make it too heavy. So, I thought, let's make this a pumpkin spice, keep it easy, but then we will make a pumpkin spice cream cheese spread to go over the top with a little bit of maple syrup. See here? This is what I ended up with these little bits and roly polies in there. We don't want them. So into this bowl, we're going to put our eggs. Actually, I need two eggs. One handed, y'all. And it did not break. Into the bowl. Dos. I'll, uh, I'll use a different wire whip. A different wire whip? Yep. So I will just blend my flowers together now that they're all smooth. And Elizabeth, you can pour in, you've got two eggs, you've got three quarters of a cup of almond milk and a quarter cup of heavy cream for a total of one cup liquid. I am I am the assistant, true assistant today, y'all. And last back. but not least, we have to add a little vanilla. Just a teaspoon of vanilla. Of you can, uh, well, then get the teaspoon. I was just letting you know before you pour it. I was just okay, doing a teaspoon of vanilla. That's a half. <laughs> okay, do it. We'll do a half. One, one, I'm almost out. Anyway. One here. Let me see. Well, it was a half. Because <laughs> that's all I have left. <laughs> Is there more? Not in there enough. Um, so give it, beat it really nice and get that all mixed in. And then we're going to add wet to dry. Our, our uh, recipe is not posted yet. The, the waffle recipe guys is already on my website it's www.ketoforreallifepeople.com you can just type in the search bar or go to recipes waffles the only difference in this recipe is i've added a tablespoon of pumpkin <laughs> pie spice so that's what's going to give them some nice pumpkin pie right. flavor now then you can pour and i will stir we're going to put the wet into the dry stir pour good so there we go and we're just going to mix it until it's smooth I'm trying to do this whole Some thing. of the other waffle recipes we're going to do this week will not be, they won't all be this 
they won't be this batter with something different. They're going to be a little, a little different in different ways for different reasons, guys. So now that's mixed. And it looks so pretty, y'all. You want to see what it looks like? It looks just like pumpkin pie filling. Mm. And it smells delicious. It smells absolutely it delicious. Does. It smells like one of those, like, you could eat it before you, like, get it. So oh. I've already got the waffle maker nice and hot. And I've, I've got some stuff over here that I was going to use. I want to spray. This is a, a new spray that I got. It was a gift that was sent to me in the mail. Uh, it is Chosen Foods Coconut Oil Spray. Comes out really nice. Ooh, got Whoa, your toes. My toes. Got your toes. And wait, let's turn it sideways. So we'll make it. There see. we go. Wow. Isn't that cool? That is like a, that's why, like, why be careful. Spread. It's going to get on you. There we go. Nice and hot. And then we are going to take about two ladlefuls of waffle thing here. Now, if you were doing this with the, one of those mini ones, you were going to do this at least six times, okay? Eight to times. This is a big man pajama. So down it goes, and now I just wait for this light to go green, and we have a waffle. So we're going to need a plate. This is going to be a quick live, isn't it? It really is. It's going to be a super quick live, y'all. That's, that's why I'm going to do so many lives this over. week. We're just going to do quick ones. And she and you know what? She's got um, maple pecan chalk zero uh, syrup for this. I am not a syrup girl with my waffles or my pancakes. I am a uh, put butter on it, call it good. She, on the other hand, is like uh, I like syrup drowned it. So I don't necessarily like it too drowned, but now I have already got this made up, guys, and I'm just gonna tell you what I did, and I'm gonna post the recipe afterwards because I did not want to make up two batches of this. It, I had to try it before. Before I give it to you guys, some of these recipes I'm doing right off the top. Y'all are just giving me, um, this is what I think will work, and it guess what? It worked. I at least made the waffles once today. It was like, oh, wiener, wiener, chicken dinner. Do and this and this? No, nope, I'm done. So I will tell you what this is. This is cream cheese, six ounces. Uh, two tablespoons of butter, softened. Mix it all up. Add a third of a cup of pumpkin puree. Give a stir. I used a half a cup of powdered erythritol. Give it a stir, and you have a pumpkin spread. Oh, we have sugar -free, sugar -free. And we do. We do, we do, we do. So this is so good, you guys. You can just spread it right across. You can still butter it up. You could layer this up. You can make it a dessert, or you can make it a special Saturday morning because you're eating clean all week, right? You've got yes. five days a week you're eating clean. This is a beautiful fall recipe. This would be good for Thanksgiving morning. Guys, you could have a whole stack of pumpkin spice waffles all made up. You can use them as a sandwich if you like. She was making some of these up earlier when I got in from lunch. And I ended up going, I had uh, some of her chicken nuggets that she had made last night and some turnip greens. You know, that's what I made today. So, in moderation, in moderation, time. everything is good. Yes, these are keto, guys. Look, we've got beautiful waffles. Voila. Got a little bit of overfill right there. And that is how quick it goes. I'm going to only do... It has this strange nozzle. It's like I'm telling you, you're going to get hit by it here. Yes. So we're going to spread a little butter. We're going to do it upright. Then we're we're going to, yeah. I know. Can I'm I gonna, be like... Okay, we gotta do half with, with stuff and half without stuff. So this makes, with this batch, with this size waffle maker and this size batch, it really only makes about six waffles. Do you want me to stack them? Do you want me to do a stack? You could do a stack. I think I'm gonna do a stack. Boom shakalaka. Oh. Boom shakalaka laka loom bak. Hey, hey, I'm gonna tell you all something too. <laughs> I don't know. I've been doing oh, that all oh week. That I've been hearing boom shakalaka in my head all Me week. and Danielle used to boom shakalaka. Here, I'm well, gonna we do, were watching I'm gonna a football movie. I'm gonna do one stack. Do you do syrup on yours? I don't do syrup on mine. Okay. So we each get. But I want some of this. I'm going this to cream here. Well, I was just. Are you gonna put it in the middle? Or yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'll do it like. If do you let these. So get you cool? like how we do this? This is what we do. Oh wait, wait, I haven't buttered it. Okay. Well, even without butter, let me tell you, you can take this cream and you can put it between your waffles and you can put it in your freezer while after it's cool. You can make ice cream. You could make a pumpkin spice waffle frozen sandwich. That's a lot of that stuff on there. But I'm not going to put any on the top. 
So I've got, and I'm, I, hey, uh, go big or go home. We're in Texas. That's all I gotta say about it. I'm that. a butter girl, y'all. Look at her fancy and it all up. Okay, that's her oh. side. Okay. I'm leaving her side. Okay, I got this. I want a, I want a pretty one. Pretty me up. Yes, girl, that's what I'm talking about. Now then, I'm not going to do it here. Sarah. I'm going to show you all. This is just I'm going to go crazy. I'm going to go easy. I wish I had one of those little teeny tiny, teeny ah. tiny. I got to go easy. We got a whole walk a week, and this is all the maple I got. I just am doing it for picture's sake. <gasps> oh, you got your high. Oh, don't take mine. <laughs> hold on. Oh, I was like, hold on. Okay. You got a mini one. Yeah, I guess I like that. Oh, yeah. I'm going to go Oh, really? She had to show me up. She does this. Because I got the skills. Whatever. Okay, so that's all you do, guys. Now, I'm going to... My drawer is stuck. <laughs> Did you get two drawers or one? No, my drawer is stuck. <laughs> oh. That's all. No. Why is it? <laughs> there we go. Okay, we got it. Green light on this. I need to play... When the light turns green, my waffles are done. I got two paper plates. <laughs> That's okay. There we go. Paper plate. Extra waffles. Waffle is done. I'm going to unplug okay. this. And we got to have fun with it. Okay. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Okay. Let's okay. walk up there. All right. We're going to. We're kind of. With what would you just walk? It was sure. I was reading. We're just walking. We're walking and talking. I'm going to really tilt that in there for you guys this way. And then I'm going to tilt this in there for you guys. I'm trying to do this dual. Dual, dual yeah, lives. we are dual right now. We have two cameras going, one on YouTube, one on Facebook. So, oh, let me turn it. Yours, your, the, yeah. Your way. Wait, Mine's wait, wait. the plain wait. way, y'all. I like the plain. Keep it clean. Keep it simple. Make it fancy. Do it as a dessert. The, uh, whip, the whipped cream is sugar free. And you, oh gosh, you guys, you should have seen All this. Right. Just squeeze out, melt. I still love that for sure. Oh, you're ready. I want to see hearts, guys. Could you please share, 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 share? Mmm. Okay, excuse me. Try mine. Mine's a little dry. Mine's not. <laughs> she does that. <laughs> I'm choking on mine. <laughs> I'm gonna go for yours now. Your dry waffle. Well, <laughs> <laughs> off the off camera, I probably put a lot Did more you? butter on it. Just, good God, there's nothing even squeezing out of this. <laughs> I need some of my stuff in there. I did mine in yours. <laughs> Um, mm, mine's better. It's good. I mean, it's good. It tastes like pumpkin spice bread. I like bread. mine better because you have a lot of that cream cheese in the middle. Oh, it's so good. I'm going to Anyways, out. this is what's for dinner tonight. We're going to eat a lot of waffles this week. I'll tell you what my scale says at the end of the week, okay? I'm not going to eat a lot of waffles because I will say no. <laughs> oh, guys, I got, you got to see the bite itself. You, you, let me see. Let me get close to this one. It's so ooey gooey. It is so ooey gooey, guys. I told y'all she drowns, right? She said, no, I don't. This is my favorite part. You want to see the butter? Like <laughs> I'm like, I'm not, don't trip it on the floor. <laughs> like, yes. No. Oh. That's the bite. Look. Oh, oh, I have. Uh, they can't see it. You got it toward me. I was letting you see. No, that's the bite. That's the bite. I'm telling oh, you. We're done with the bite. We got the bites. Guys, these are going to be quick waffle tutorials all week long. It's going to give you lots of ideas. When I get off of here, I'm going to sit down and be a good girl and go put the cream cheese together and put the recipe on. And um, I'm going to just go under my keto waffle recipe. Uh, I, I don't know that I should do a pumpkin spice waffle recipe. So I think I'll, I'll get it. I'll get it so that you guys can get the cream cheese filling. All you do is add a tablespoon. I'll put variations for the original. You know, we might even do a chaffle. Mmm. Because I can tell y'all, I did an egg waffle the other day. And it was delicious. I stacked it all up, had cheese in it. I want to see what we got here. Pass on over, please. Yes, do the pumpkin recipe. Yes, yes, I will, guys. Oat fiber, yes. Oat fiber is... You know, there's uh, on oats... There is a husk, and they they husk them, and then they roll them, and you get oatmeal, right? But the little fibers, the husks on them, is ground up and made into a fiber, a flour, if you will, 
it zeroes out and it's low on the glycemic index. So we use it to make a, a flour blend. Andrea, Andrea, sorry if I ever say y'all's names wrong. I just can't read. Oh, I can't even eat anymore. Um, I'm so full. Yeah, I'm full. Okay, and that's right. the thing, okay, they're super so I got halfway through two, so that equals one. One and done. I I'm ate one. Um, well, it's just sugar-free, whipped heavy, cr heavy cream from Walmart. It's and the it's, great value version. It works really good. Mm. <laughs> it, it is sweetened with sucralose, y'all, but sucralose is in our Diet Coke. So I've had this for two weeks. It's still full. We don't do it very often. Um, I just actually opened that. I just now opened that before this live or during Where this live. Where did our liquid go? Your liquid is gone. Oh, I'm so thirsty. She has been so thirsty all day. Okay, um, that's it, Mom. I think that's it. I'm gonna wrap it up real quick. I'm gonna see a couple of comments, and then we're gonna call it done, guys. Uh, I'm gonna look on YouTube first because you're looking at Facebook, right? Yes, I'm looking um, at Facebook. Let's go. Got about. me a dash mini waffle iron. It's pumpkin shaped for chaffles. How cool! Hi from Missouri. Looking great, Elizabeth. Looking beautiful. Thank you. Loving pumpkin. This is perfect timing. I just got home from work, so happy to watch live. Oh. Hiya. Hey. Hi. Hey. Hey. There we go. Will the recipe be posted on this thread? The recipe link will be added to this thread, so you can just tap it, guys. I don't write the recipe out and share it everywhere because it gets lost. I will go to my website. I will type it in. I will share the link in the title description or below on YouTube. You will just hit the little button below the title. It'll drop down. It'll say recipe link. Tap it. Takes you right to the recipe. Can I just say I'm back here getting all excited because last year this time I was not keto. I wasn't even very coherent. And she, oh, she does fall the best, y'all. It's, fall, it's my favorite you know, time of the year. It's my favorite time of the year, so I know it's that last the year. the most wonderful time of the year. <laughs> so last year, she came out with cheesecake. She came out with fat bombs. She came out with pecan pie. She came out with zucchini bread. She came out with uh, carrot Dressing. cake. Non, well, not really carrot cake. 24, 24 carrot gold, gold cake. Carrot yes. gold cake. Um, casseroles. Dressing, casseroles. And this year, I get to enjoy it guilt-free on keto. And we feasted last fall y'all when we did not gain weight no so, she stayed exactly the same still same today so one year later i'm still the same and, <laughs> and on the other hand remember eat clean five days a week have your two days that's how you do that's how that's how i do it how do you do it eat clean and get active and enjoy your weekends and have some fun foods and we're gonna have so many ways to do waffles y'all and not all of them are going to be covered in sugary sweeteners <laughs> And no, everything. I think we should do some We're, savories. I've got five savories. I've got five sweets. That's ten waffle recipes. We just clicked one off. We've nice. got some, um, and I got I got a surprise up my sleeve, but until I give it a whirly whirl, then um, I just want to keep it to myself. But we got some big things coming, okay? And I can't wait to share them with you. You guys have been great. Thanks for being patient with us. Thank you for being patient with me in particular, y'all. Uh, I've got a lot I'm juggling right now in my real life keto world. And so uh, I will be on all throughout this week. One constant will be Facebook. I will be doing my live Facebook. Today it was a YouTube live and a Facebook live. Tomorrow it might be a Facebook and an Instagram live. So I'm going to try to hit all the different things. But I will put uh, Facebook as my main live and, and then we'll branch out. All yes. right. If I had three ways, I'd go three right now. I would do all three and be all done at, at one time. But I'll share from wherever I'm at, y'all. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you to all of my supporters. Uh, donations are are over on YouTube. Thank you, guys, for anybody who donated. Um, what else we got? Oh, remember share. Share, yeah, share. share. Like, share. Get this out. It's fall. Pumpkin's coming up. And share my YouTube I channel. Mean, you guys, subscribe. Hold on. That, I think, took from start to finish 15 minutes. Yeah. That was it. Did you catch that comment? Because I'm so short. I mean, I'm It says, literally... this looks so delicious. I can't wait to try this recipe. Thanks for all you do to help us have a wonderful, yummy keto diet. Well, that was my goal this week. I said it. My crazy brain goes off, and I just want to be able to create recipes that are not only good and taste authentic, that keto people can enjoy and feel like they're regular people. But I want regular people to taste these recipes when you guys make them and go, you know, I could do keto. This is this is really good, you know. From ice cream to pizzas to burgers to casseroles, 
We got it, guys. And for anyone that you know that is in a younger age bracket and you want them to try the keto lifestyle, I'm 29 years old. I'm 29 years old, fully keto, athletic, working out, and it is possible. So just send them our way. Between the two of us, we can get them taken care of. Um, will you start giving 30 minute uh, heads up about your life? I will, yes, I will do my best, y'all, to give a 30 minute heads up. It, you just, you know, at the beginning of every live on Facebook, you have the option to right at the very top, scroll all the way back through this live. At the very top, it says, get notified first. Tap that button. That way, when I go live, you'll see it. And then YouTube, guys, um, I just try to go on when I can because I'm not as familiar with how to work it. <laughs> as I am with uh, Facebook. So thank you all for tuning in. Remember, fats first, moderate protein, low carb. Get you some. Get you some. You got two steps over there. All right. I don't even know where it is. Oh. Up there at the X. Sorry, guys. Mm -hmm. I did it. It didn't work. Okay. Tap it.